Hello there, and welcome into my sports talk show. I am your host, Carolation Jr. It's great to be bringing you my sports talk show on this Friday afternoon. Happy TGI for everybody. And now let's talk right about the NHL, where there's only two NHL games, and I have you covered for both games for tonight. As the Philadelphia Flyers take on the Buffalo Sabres at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, 6 p.m. Central Time, and 4 p.m. Pacific Time out west. And then the last NHL game for the night is the New Jersey Devils battling the St. Louis Blues at 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 7 p.m. Central Time, and 5 p.m. Pacific Time out west. And now let's talk about the NBA. And I brought you... There's a handful of NBA games, but I brought you two out of a handful for tonight. As the Washington Wizards take on the Miami Heat at 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 7 p.m. Central Time, and 5 p.m. Pacific Time out west. And later on at night, the Dallas Mavericks head up north and battle the world champs, the Denver Nuggets, at 10 p.m. Eastern Time, 9 p.m. Central Time, and 7 p.m. Pacific Time out west. If you want to get the rest of your NBA schedule for tonight, go to nba.com slash schedule or go to espn.com slash NBA schedule. And now let's hop right over to NFL Week 9 for Sunday. There's Sunday morning football yet again as the Miami Dolphins take on the Kansas City Chiefs at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time, 8.30 a.m. Central Time, and 6.30 a.m. Pacific Time out west. And then later on in the afternoon, the Washington Commanders go into Gillette Stadium and try to quiet the New England Patriots, or the New England Patriots have the last laugh. That game will be at 1 p.m. Eastern Time, 12 p.m. Central Time, and 10 a.m. Pacific Time out west. If you want to get the rest of your NFL Week 9 schedule, including Monday Night Football, Go over to NFL Week 9 Schedule or ESPN.com slash NFL Week 9 Schedule. I hope everybody has a great rest of Friday afternoon, Friday evening, Friday night. Hope you guys have a great weekend. This has been Carly Shin Jr. signing off. Until next week, thank you for watching.